Hi guys, the internet is full of videos with perpetual motion machines. So let's give it a try and build one. Uh, exactly it's uh, this thing here, rotating wheel. And I didn't want to buy all these tools and, and wood and do all this handicraft. So I tried to build it with a uh, gaming engine. So a gaming engine is using uh, classical physics, uh, no fancy stuff. And the thing we can see here is using also classical physics. So if it really worked, it should also work with the gaming engine. This was my idea. So this is what I did. This is my virtual perpetual motion machine. I copied everything accurately, except for one thing. I turned off any friction. So this virtual thing should in fact work better than the, the real thing on the video. The gaming engine allows to connect objects with joints. This is what I did here. And these joints allow also to set a limit on the angle. So the bars can only move inside about 90 degrees back and forth. Okay, we are all set. Let's start the thing. Oh, I think we need to push it a bit. I can turn on a torque force here and wow, it's, it's spinning. It's spinning, wow, it's spinning. And now we turn it off. Ah, uh, okay. Not working. Hmm. Okay, well, I think this was it. Uh, but maybe there is some quantum field wobbling kind of effect going on that makes the real thing work. If you have any idea how to bring that thing into motion, uh, you can download the source code for this Unity project from our website. Uh, link is here. And I guess no free energy for the rest of us. Sorry guys, uh, I'm out of here.